Employees of the Islamic Court in Aleppo are now receiving their wages in Turkish lira instead of Syrian pounds. It is one of a growing number of opposition-run institutions in northern Syria which have started to use Turkey's currency. The local council of Aleppo, which operates in rebel areas, is behind the decision which it hopes will help the Syrian economy collapse. The Islamic Court, just like other rebel-run organizations, welcomed this decision, and the people have welcomed being paid in Turkish lira. The Syrian pound has lost its value over the years. When the civil war began in March 2011, one U.S. dollar could be exchanged for 47 pounds. The rate now is at least 190 pounds. Prices of basic goods, many of them now imported, have risen dramatically. The local council of Aleppo believes its decision will help people because of the lira stability against the U.S. dollar. But there are others who believe it may be linked to Turkey's plan to create a so-called safe haven in opposition-controlled northern Syria. The hope of Turkish government to bring up a safe zone or secure zone, what we might call a de facto zone, uh, we might say that uh, the opposition's uh, decision uh, might be in advance uh, getting ready uh, to governance uh, in this area somehow. The Turkish government hopes the military campaign to get rid of ISIL in the Aleppo countryside will strengthen rebel groups there and lead to a safe zone for refugees. It has been years since the government lost control of much of northern Syria, but it has been fighting to keep the western half of Aleppo city, which was once Syria's financial capital. And there are reports that its main ally, Iran, is suggesting placing the divided city under international protection as part of a potential peace deal. The opposition's decision to stop using Syrian pounds in the north is a sign that rebels have no plans to reconcile with the government in Damascus. It is also being seen as an indication of Turkey's growing influence in this corner of Syria. Zana Khudr al-Jazeera, Beirut.